Right then, in this video we're following on from the part one about the general feelings around health. Uh, this one is going to be some more medical uh, terminology surrounding, uh, surrounding health and medicine. So, medical, little circle, medical, across the chest, medical. I'll start with medicine. Medicine, that's medicine in general. I think it comes from a container for uh, drugs or pill bottle, that kind of thing. Medicine. Very basic things, we've got bandages. They wrap around things, bandages. Sutures, they're just special medical stitches, so the sign for suture is like a circular stitch. Suture. An injection with a needle, injection. Injection, we're pushing it into the skin and injecting. Injection. Blood, blood. It comes over the finger, blood. Um, right then, okay. To examine, we start with our four fingers at our face and we end with our little fingers away. Examine. Examine. So we could have a blood test. We could examine a blood. Blood test. Yeah. Or that could be used in the context of taking temperature. So examine temperature. Um, and we've talked about temp temperature in the last video. Blood pressure then. Blood pressure, pressure, because you wear a cuff around the arm and you inflate it, so you could either have blood pressure or pressure for a blood uh, pressure test. An operation or surgery involves cutting um, generally into the body, and that sign for operation and surgery is our thumb drawing a line across our stomach, signifying uh, cutting into your abdomen. So, we've had operation surgery. Okay, you could also be given um, a prescription from a doctor to take drugs. So the prescription is the same as a sign for a uh, ticket. It's prescription. It's like a sheet of paper, a list of things on that paper. So it's prescription. Prescription. Easy. And on that prescription you could have some drugs. The sign for drugs is drugs. So it's flicking your finger towards your mouth. Drugs. Um, not to be confused with popcorn and fireworks, because this is drugs. This is drugs. Um, they're quite small motion. Popcorn is the same, but both hands, and a bit faster. And fireworks is very similar again, but an even bigger motion. Fireworks. They all make sense. You just kind of don't want to be telling someone that you are prescribing the fireworks. I don't know. Okay. Um, so those drugs could come in a, uh, a blister pack of tablets, and so this could also be a, a sign for uh, drugs or tablets, and it's like lots of little points on a packet. You know, the ones where you might poke it through the, the, the foil on one side and the plastic on the other, and they all sit in the little blister pack. Mm -mm. An x-ray. You might um, have an x-ray. The sign that I do is X light, x-ray. Uh, Lots of people just spell it, but I don't think there's a really uh, overarching best thing to do. It's quite a, um, an explanatory sign. X-ray. You could be given a tube or bottle of cream for a, a ailment, whatever that might be. And this is one that might be more applicable for someone in their day-to-day -day life if they spotted someone who is in need. Um, the sign for choking. It's very universal, but you would want to perhaps be able to ask someone um, if you knew they were deaf, or someone you didn't know but wasn't really responding to you. Choking. That is, not responding to you, and they're conscious and seeing you. Um, right then, next. Emergency signs. Emergency. Emergency is the same for the sign for quick. Emergency. Uh, ambulance. Ambulance is a flashing light, and it rotates because it's, you know, the motion of the light to get attention. Ambulance. Heart attack. We've had headache with a similar motion where we have spiky fingers over an area, and there's, there's something bad going on in that area. Well, heart attack is the same. Heart attack. Over the heart. Heart attack. So, that's the, the apex of the heart. Um, heart attack. We might have uh, a patient in hospital, 
the sign for hospital is hospital. And I always thought it was very similar to train. I mean, this isn't the sign for train. I just thought train whenever I saw hospital. Um, but it comes from uh, the wards and the rows of beds. So that is a single ward, a room with the, with the rows of beds. Uh, I talked about examine. That could also be for a suspected thing. So you could say a suspected heart attack. Suspected heart attack. Perfect. I think that's everything. Awesome, yeah. If you haven't seen the earlier video, uh, it has some more general terms surrounding health and feelings around health. So check that one out. Perfect. Thank you.